Refine's Guilty Pleasure is back tonight. The competition is getting stiff on The Bachelorette, and it's also getting pretty awkward. To get you caught up on tonight's episode, here's our Refine Roundtable. The Bachelor has finally gotten back to basics. After four weeks of love and drama, Tasha's season is a breath of fresh air. I couldn't be more excited about this week's episode, but we got to talk about last week's because you know what it was? Just a lot of fun. So they started out with a group date challenge, which they're calling the Grown Ass Man Challenge. And they take the guys through a series of things that make you groan, which is, I think, a spelling competition, a math competition, how good of a cook you are. Mr. Harvard had more wrong answers than I did for sure. And I went to Arizona State. Bennett remains my favorite. And clearly, he has leaned into his persona. This is a man who presented Tasha with a plate of beignets. Now there's no chance he scratch made a bunch of beignets in 10 minutes in a high school gymnasium, okay? But that is what happened. But it's bougie, okay? He's bougie and I'm bougie, so I appreciate it. This episode also presented us with a beef between two dudes who have no chance at winning this show. This is their moment to shine. It's Ed, who I called Frankenstein for the first five weeks because I didn't know his name, and Chasen, who is essentially a the perfect embodiment of a bro. All right, Appreciate well, it all. We'll, we'll take your medium shirt and sit down. My medium shirt, it's actually large. Our final group date, it was a wrestling match, which I don't know what producers were thinking. This was a bloodbath, and it was always destined to be a bloodbath. Oh, 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 oh. oh my gosh. It was fun, uh, but yeah, I got my ass kicked. The standout of the wrestling match was my boy, Joe. Yes. Society needs to protect Joe at all costs. He is just a breath of fresh air on this show. Grocery store Joe walked so anesthesiologist Joe could run. I know I should say something like, I was born for this, or hell yeah, or I was, I was, I'm ready for this, but uh, uh, I'm also a little scared. I want to see Joe find love. I will not be able to rest until Joe finds love. It sucks to lose, but I'm a lover, I'm not a fighter. As crazy as it sounds, we're getting toward the end of Tasha's season. So who are your front runners? My big number one is Ivan. I think he's not only handsome, but he clicks with Tasha and he's hilarious and well-rounded. I'm gonna be a little devil's advocate here and say, I'm kind of rooting for my boy Noah. I'm not, I, I like him. I don't know how much I'll like him next week, but I like him now. So, Stan's mustache and all. I also agree about Noah. Once he got rid of that stash, he was way hotter. I'm also a little bit more Team Ben because that kiss they got, that they had, they shared, was kind of intense and I was feeling it. I'm riding for my guy, Brendan. They had the best one-on-one -on -one date I have ever seen on this show. I hope they end up together at the end because, uh, you know what? Nice guys can finish first. Well, then we should all root for Joe. <laughs> The Bachelorette airs Tuesday nights right here on Como 4.